Hey, what's up guys and gals? My name is Rick Nige. Thank you for joining me looking at another Three Stooge short. We are in season two looking at the second short of the Three Stooges called Dizzy Doctors. Filming of this short was completed between December 9th and 12th, 1936, and the short premiered March 19th, 1937. In regards to the title, this is the first of the Three Stooge shorts with the word Dizzy in the title. In this short, the Stooges play three lazy husbands that do not want to go to work and of course their wives are fed up with them. So they make them leave the house and go to work. Desperate for work, the boys stumble upon Brido Medical Company. They mistakenly believe that this is some type of chemical company, but instead it's a type of medicinal company. So they become salesmen and try to sell as much product as they can. Have you ever sold anything? Have we ever sold anything? Have we ever sold anything? Have we? Come on, come on! Brido! Righto, makes old buddies new. We'll sell a million bottles. <laughs> I'm going to point out that this short has a lot of references to the season one short number three episode entitled Men in Black. In fact, you're going to see a lot of parallels and I'm going to point them out to you. The first one being the Stooges knocking down this table full of Brido bottles. They do the same thing over and over in this short, but they also do it in Men in Black after they close the door and the glass pane breaks. Very similar concept there. Can I rub a little of this on your body? You just try it if you want a good punch in the nose. Hey, boss, Brighto, you'll never forget it as long as you live. Neither will I. Open a jiffy. Oh, great. It's gone? <laughs> it's just another... I'll say it's gone. Good. Give me a bottle. The Stooges even begin to clean someone's car. However, they're not really cleaning it. Hey, this stuff's taking the paint off. Police! Help! Now pay attention to this blooper here. We have Vernon Dent in the background, whose car that is. And then we see Mother's Pies with the man holding the pies. The Stooges bump into him and the pies go flying up in the air and they fall. All the pies either fell on the floor or on the car. Now we go to a shot of Vernon Dent. All the pies have already lost their momentum. And in this shot we see possibly a cast member toss a pie into Vernon Dent's face. In order to escape, the boys jump in the back of an ambulance. Pay attention to where they're taking. Lost Arms Hospital, ambulance entrance. This is the same hospital that we see season one, short number three of the Stooges from the episode Men in Black. Pretty cool. Notice a very similar sign in the short Men in Black while also seeing the building that was used, which is currently now a Scientology building in Los Angeles, California. Going back to Dizzy Doctors, Take a notice at this set. This is the exact same set and backdrop that was used in Men in Black. Pretty cool that they reused the same set. Even this is reminiscent of Men in Black. Calling Dr. Jones. Calling Dr. Jones. Hey, me wants to know what to do for inflammation. Why call us? Tell him to dial inflammation. If that little melody sounds familiar to you, those tones are a parody of the GEC pattern used for the NBC chimes. I'll keep quiet or I'll suck you again. Are you listening? Now don't go away, ladies and gentlemen. We'll soon be with you. The Stooges even put some Brido on a patient's head because he has dandruff and that causes him to lose his hair. Poor guy. The Stooges are surprised to find out that the Vernon Dent character is the one who owned the car and when he sees him in the hospital, he chases him out of the building. The ending of this short has a lot of bloopers, so let's take a look. As the Stooges go out, notice them on the gurney and the sheet they're using for a sail. Notice in the second shot with the officer how rigid the sail has become, and now you see it's a different type of material. It's more like a cardboard or even wooden surface. Notice this man in the background. His name is Solomon Horowitz. You might have heard of him. He's the real father of Mo, Shemp, and Curly. He appears as a street onlooker in this scene. He also appears in the courtroom audience in the short Disorder in the Court, which I have done a video about, so take a look at that if you haven't. 
Solomon and his wife Jenny were in town visiting their famous sons when these classic films were made and they were asked to be in the film. Notice this double here, which you can clearly see is neither Mo, Larry, or Curly. Notice as Larry comes in that he looks nothing like the double that was before him who jumped in first. Pretty funny. Dude. Thank you so much guys and gals for supporting me in my videos. It really does mean a lot to me and for the progression of my channel. I will see you all next time and don't forget if you have not seen the rest of my Three Stooges videos, I Love Lucy videos, or any of my content to go explore and browse and see what you can find. As I always remind you, push through any negativity and any difficulties. We all have them big or small. What sets us apart is that we can push forward and not focus on it guys and gals. Let's focus on just the positivity. Don't forget how valuable you are, and most importantly, be hopeful.